This is Pam Smith with Farm Journal Magazine. I'm here with Tom Fry at Grinnell, Iowa. And uh, Tom, you're in Ma Minnesota, right? Yep, I'm and located in Mankato. Okay, and tell me what you do there. I'm the regional agronomy lead for DeKalb and Asgro. I work with 20 agronomists across seven states. And my role is to help them think about how we provide technical ag agronomic support to our dealers and customers. What are you seeing out in the field this year? You know, it's a year of extremes, Pam. It's one where we're going to see both uh, incredible yields in spite of Mother Nature throwing us some unexpected stresses, um, but it's one when we talk across the range of states that I work that um, I couldn't really give you one answer that would probably be correct. Uh, if we focus in, in Iowa and Nebraska, we're going to see some record crops in corn and soybeans. Um, despite having cooler than normal temperatures, some of the above average moisture allowed us to probably maximize our conditions. Now we just need uh, a break in the weather weeks so we can get that crop harvested. Um, as we go north, that cool conditions translated into a killing frost that was premature and, and some of those environments, some of our yields are going to be limited, um, and, but uh, I think still be a pleasant surprise across southern Minnesota and into South Dakota. Today we saw some of the first packages of Smart Stacks being uh, put in the bag. Yeah. What farmers should be considering that technology? You know, this is a neat milestone today that yeah. um, sure. the first DeKalb Genuity Smart Stacks are coming through this plant. And it really is the start of a new era. Uh, I've been an agronomist for 20 years working in the seed industry. And when we talk with farmers every year about that seed purchase that they're going to make, which is the most critical decision they make every year in terms of how that's going to impact their profitability, that discussion is always balanced around what are their needs on that farm relative to how they're going to manage risk. And what's incredible about what Monsanto has been able to bring to the farmer is both increases in the inherent yield potential through innovative new breeding techniques from increasing the yield potential of the hybrids in the decal bag and then providing new technologies like Genuity Smart Stacks that allow us to protect that yield potential and do it in a way that gives us more stability because of a greater number of modes of action for both above ground and below ground insect pests. So it is the start of a, a, a new kind of platform from which we will bring additional technologies in the future that uh, I think will allow us to hopefully achieve that uh, goal that we've talked about, which is um, a sustainable yield initiative of doubling yields by 2030. And you told me uh, that there's still availability of smart stacks that if growers really are interested that they can still get some of that in the bag, right? Absolutely. This is a launch year, so 2010 means that uh, we're not going to be have supplies to plant, uh, uh, you know, entire farms to smart stacks. But we'd encourage growers who are interested in finding out more to talk to the local dealer, and uh, particularly those uh, willing to make a commitment earlier in the in the season.